how we doing everyone welcome back to another video on this video I'm carp fishing as you might have guessed right hand rod is just over there on the island and the left left hand rod is just over here on this island I've got a snowman on both two different baits had a couple of bleeps on the left hand rod nothing on the right yet so yeah see how we get on down here it's a new lake never fished it before let's see how we get on apparently they like pellet in here so i'm so seen from the other videos so i'm going to give the right hand rod a change in a bit on the pellet and see what happens no, I do find normally halibut pellets a little bit too uh, it's a bit too cold for it just yet but I'll give it a try I normally find it more of a summer bait because it's so oily you hear the old car passing by right near a road so yeah I thought I'd give a put a carp fishing video up for you guys because I haven't brought a any carp fishing videos up for a long time. Right, I'm gonna get the kettle on. Look at the state of that, look. I'm gonna lick it clean in a minute. It's been like that for years, so. Mm, probably tastes very nice, all the fat on there. So I'm gonna get the kettle on, have a brew, bait up some rigs. I'm gonna put a wafter out on the left, and then I'm gonna put um, a pellet on the right. Give it a change up because nothing's happening on the snowman. So bring you back when I get a fish. I'll tell you what, I'll bring you back when I'm gonna set me uh, rigs up and then when I get a fish. Speed you in a bit. Right everyone, this is what I'm going with. I've got a halibut pellet with a nut boiling on the end. It's only a 14 mil, size 8 hook, just a basic air rig. That's some fox. A coated braid and a curved shank hook just with a anti-tangle sleeve on the end so I'm gonna put this little bag on as well pellet hook that on and see what we get and on the other rod I'm just going to use um, a waff uh, a D rig with a, one of my white wafters so, let's get them out. That's what I just had out there. Little um 80mm and 10mm uh, pop up on top, snowman. But yeah, nothing. And that's probably been out there for about right, uh, over three hours or so. Not even a sniff. If I was, do if I was doing a longer session, then I would have left it out there longer, but as I'm only doing a day session, I just want to nick a couple of fish. So, let's try something. There you go, that's what's going out. I just showed you. And there's the bag that's going on with it. I'm just going to catapult some, some uh, pellet over the top of it. 
finally guys after three and a half hours a bag one so let's get it weighed on the pellet actually that was on a pellet tipped with um, a, a nut boilie there you are guys 15 what was it 1550 look at that what a beaut Right, I'll show you a steel. I'm going to slip it back now. There she goes. Beautiful. Well, it's the right rod back out there again. Same again with the pellet. Let's see what happens. Just fired about six six small pellets over the top. And I did put a little bag on as well. So that's enough. Never overfeed them. If they're there, they come back for it. Let's see if we can get another one. Sparrow walk, guys. Fascinating creatures they are. Gone. Finally, people, another one. Nice common this time. He's just in there. Boy, did he scrap. That was on the pellet again. Right, let's get it, get it weighed. Well, guys, look at that. On the pellet, right on the side of the lip. I think this one's definitely a bit bigger this time. Right in the side. On a long shank. Right. I'm going to get this, get this weighed. Bring you back. Right, let's see where this baby goes, guys. This is weighing in at 20 pounds. Here we are guys, £18.46 on the pellet, what a stunner, put up a good fight as well, harder than the, harder than the last one I had, but these commons, they always do, don't they? Right, going we get slipped back, and hopefully for another one. goes straight out the net slingshot though third one of the day not as big as the other two but still always welcome I'm happy with that three fish today on a day sesh not a bad start this fish is cold the water still must be cold right Oh, look at that mouth on it though, look. Good condition. Perfect. Let's get this little butte back. See if we can get another one before we go. Is it ain't over yet? 